The Butler Bulldogs finished last year 13-9 and and in a three-way tie for third in the Independence Division. For a squad a few years earlier who had trouble fielding a full team, that's an impressive feat. For new head coach Jason Luciani, his goal to help the team get better this year is a simple one. Teach them the Butler way of wrestling. We're trying to teach them our series, the, the system of moves. A lot of these guys have been Butler wrestlers since they're little kids, so they've come up through the system that we've had in place. So a lot of this is a refresher for them, and we try to build on what they learned since they were little. And we try to expand on it and drill it and condition and be in shape and do all the things that we're supposed to do in order to win matches. One of the wrestlers who are used to the Butler way of doing things is Dan Castiglia. The senior, who has an outside chance at 100 wins for a career this season, works hard in the room and wants to pass that along to help the squad going forward, not only this year, but in the future. Uh, I think we're just working on every day, getting better, working on technique, going live, working on your moves, doing everything right, one step at a time, get you better every day. A wrestler on the team who will help the Bulldogs get better is senior Garrett O'Shea, who transferred back after three years at Morris Knowles. O'Shea finished fourth at 113 a year ago and should lock down the lower weights for this squad. This is a good, solid team, and I like where they're going. They're building off the standard that former coach Chris Wells put in place and are trying to take it to the next level. I think this team could compete, but it'll be tough for them to win their conference. I look for them to finish near 500 and fourth in the Independence Division. For GardenStateHSWrestling.com, Donald J. Brower reporting.